2023 is quickly approaching. And just like you guys, I'm out here trying to elevate every single day. Okay, I want to become my very, very, very best version in 2023. But one thing that I've realized about New Year's resolutions is that more often than not, they don't work. Okay, think about it. Did you stick to your resolutions for 2022? Probably not. Okay, if you did, you probably wouldn't be watching this video in the first place. And that is why you need to start laying the groundwork right here, right now, at the end of 2022, so that you can hit the ground running in 2023. This is the biggest mistake that I see a lot of people make, is they project their best versions. They project their new beginnings into the future, a future that doesn't actually exist. You see, something that people don't understand about time, although we all inherently understand it, but at the surface level, they don't understand that there is no such thing as the past or the future. There is only the present moment. You will never be in the future. You will never be in the past. You will only ever be in the present moment. You will only ever experience life through the lens, through the frame of this present moment. One analogy that I like to draw is imagine being on a train. Imagine that you're on a train at the train station and you get on the train, you ride the train to another train station. When the door is open, you're still on that same train, but now you're at a different station. That's how I see time. When you get to that future that you're envisioning in your mind right now, you'll still be in the present moment. You'll still be experiencing that future through the present moment. But if you don't take advantage of the present moment, you'll never actually reach that future that you're seeking out. And what a lot of you have to realize is that all you're seeking out is presence. A lot of times we set these goals because we want to elevate ourselves so that we can feel worthy so that we can then be present. The paradox of life is that all you need to do is be present. And once you're present, you are effectively living in the end per the law of assumption. And in doing so, you will begin to manifest supernatural blessings. And not only that, your perception will change. Presence enables you to change your perception. I am sitting here in Los Angeles, California. I'm sitting here in Los Angeles, California, and I pretty much live here. I don't live here permanently, but I can if I want. I can live here for as long as I want. But if I decide tomorrow that I want to go to New York City, I can do that. Why is that? It's because I became present enough to change my perspective and my perception on my current life situation. I realized that, wait a minute, I can simply relinquish my attachment to opulence and then I can have the freedom that I've been seeking out and thus the presence. But in order for me to find that presence, I had to give myself permission to experience that presence in the present moment when I was still in that apartment, when I was still up to my eyeballs in car payments and rent payments, so on and so forth, living paycheck to paycheck. Now I'm in a position where not only can I live in Los Angeles like I've always wanted to, but I can be financially free while doing so because I decided to be present. So that's the first thing that you guys need to do is be present and start laying the groundwork right now. Stop telling yourself that tomorrow you'll be a better you. Next week, next month, next year. You'll never be a better you until you decide to be present. Being present enables you to be your best version. Now, once you allow yourself to be present in the here and now, you remove the contingencies for being present, i.e. when I get rich or when I get a girlfriend, so on and so forth. First of all, like I said earlier, you'll find that a lot of these things will naturally begin to gravitate towards you. But in addition to that, you will begin to develop a higher sense of self, a better self-perception, and you'll begin to take care of yourself. You see, one thing that you guys need to understand about glowing up is that you have to take care of yourself. Okay, yes, I am a spiritual person and I believe in prioritizing your inner well-being over your outer well-being, your external well-being. But at the same time, in the same breath, your external well-being is a reflection, more often than not, of your internal well-being. So when you're taking care of yourself internally, you'll naturally find that you'll begin to take care of yourself externally as well. When you begin to be present, you are now being your best version and your outer shell will match that. And one effective way to implement a self-care routine to get started on the path to self-care is by implementing a skincare routine. And that brings me to Tej Hanley, the sponsor of today's video. You've heard me talk about them before and you're going to keep hearing me talk about them because I know the positive impact their products will have on your life. Seriously, I still don't think some of you believe me when I tell you just how much implementing a quality skincare routine will improve your confidence in all aspects of your life. Tej Hanley makes taking care of your skin uncomplicated. 
They provide you with all of the products you need and none of the products that you don't need. I personally recommend that you start with their level one skincare system, which comes with all of the basics. A daily face wash, an exfoliating scrub, an AM moisturizer with SPF 20, and a PM moisturizer. Oh, and to make it dead simple for guys like us, they provide this instruction card in every box that tells you when to use each product, how much of each product to use, and in what order to use each product. It definitely comes in clutch. Skincare wasn't always something I took seriously, but now that I have, I wish I would have started sooner. But you don't just have to take my word for it, because they have over 5,000 five-star reviews from customers all around the globe. In addition to amazing skin, members of Tiege Hanley get tons of benefits, including at least 20% off the retail price, access to exclusive monthly deals, the ability to pause or cancel your subscription at any time, and free US shipping. And because Tiege Hanley is the sponsor of today's video, they're offering my viewers, which is you guys, an amazing deal. Just click the first link in the description or the pinned comment of this video and get 30% off your first box and a free gift. That is an absolutely amazing deal. Click the link below and get started today. Now, like I said earlier, okay, you have to allow yourself to be present first and then you start to take care of your external appearance. All of that goes together, but a lot of people try to start from the outside in. They try to find their confidence in going to the gym. They try to find their confidence in the skincare routines. And while these things help, they can't substitute for present moment awareness. These things are the reflection of present moment awareness. I've been living out of my car for three days now. I'm still taking care of myself. If you just see me out and about, you would not know that I'm living in my car because I love myself. I take care of myself because I love myself, not so that I can love myself. And that's what you guys need to understand about glowing up. Glowing up is not about becoming a confident version of yourself. It's about being a confident version of yourself, loving yourself, and then acting in accordance with that feeling, with that self-perception. When you love yourself, you will treat yourself differently. For example, I love this car and I take care of it. Right now it's a little dirty because I just drove it across the country through the rain and mountains, so on and so forth. But best believe that by the end of today, if not today, then tomorrow, this car will be clean again. And I'm gonna take all of the stuff out of the back, clean that out, put some of it in the storage unit, and I'm gonna keep this car up as if it were a 5,000 square foot mansion. Because I love myself, therefore I love my environment, and I wanna take care of my environment. You see, these are all byproducts of you loving yourself in the present moment. Really, that's all you need to do to glow up. But once you begin to love yourself, taking care of your physical appearance and taking care of your external environment, whatever that may be for you. It could be your room, your car, your house, your apartment, your mansion, your island if you have one, I don't know. Taking care of your internal self as well as your external appearance and your external environment will pay exponential dividends over time. Exponential dividends over time in that your quality of life and your general sense of well-being will increase drastically. And I'm living proof of that.